1986 Chevy K5 D10 military edition. Had this thing for like six, seven years now. Oversized flares, 38 inch tires. It's got a four inch lift kit on it. It's also got airbags under it. It has a little bit of flake here and there, but all in all the frame is in perfect shape. The window does crank down. You have to grab it with a pair of pliers and crank it, but the gate opens, window goes down. Here's a little bit of the paint flaked off. <clears throat> so this truck has brand new ball joints, brand new hub assembly, the stabilizer bushings, U-joints front and back, brakes, rotors, calipers, and lines all the way around brand new. The rear drums have been replaced. The, cylinder, the wheel cylinders in the back have been replaced. All the tie rod ends. There's a brand new steering box. The rag joint's brand new. The worst spot of the truck is both inner fenders. They probably will need replaced. Rest of it's solid. As you can tell, A little bit of the surface rust. Somebody must have replaced the rocker. Interior wise, pretty basic. Got a boost gauge, it does have a turbo. I'll show you that soon. It's got the captain's chairs out of a Silverado with a center console. I believe it's out of a 2000 Silverado. This is for the glow plugs. Hold that for a little bit. Starts right up. Been sitting for a while. There we go. I need to oil up a little. but under the hood brand new batteries wiring starter the fuel filter it's got the turbo on it out of a I want to say 96 2500 Chevy Silverado American race racing alloy wheels The doors are in pretty much the same shape. Both windows open in the back. I used to ride with the roof off. Comes right off, it's not too hard. Hitch, there's a bad rust spot on it, and a tailgate. Couldn't seem to find a tailgate around my area. But, all in all, that's the truck. If you'd like to come take a look at it, you can. Um, inspection did just expire in May. 
I literally get it inspected and put maybe 50 to 100 miles on it a year and park it. I don't drive it as much as I used to. I just have too many toys. Any questions, feel free to ask.